Hey everybody, welcome back to the Fire Red Nuzlocke. In the last episode, if you haven't watched it, uh, I'm about to get into spoilers real quick as a quick summarization of what happened. We climbed the Lavender Tower, I caught a Ghastly that I named Spooky, and then we reached the Ghost Marowak. The Ghost Marowak fought valiantly. It really hurt my butter, so I switched it out with Bob, thinking, Bob's a water type. Bob can tank a few hits. He got hit a few times. He got hit by two critical hit bone meringues and died. So now we've lost our starter Pokemon, but he's still looking on words at us from over there on the right. It's sad to see you go, Bob. You were a great, great Pokemon, and I never got a chance to use my Blastoise thumbnail thing that I was going to use when you evolved. How quick of me to think that you would have lasted that long. <laughs> but now, with Spooky, hopefully we will be able to catch this Snorlax. I don't know if Snorlax can hit Spooky. Uh, the thing is, I couldn't get any Pokeballs. I don't think Pokeballs are sold in Lavender Town. I didn't check. And you can't get them in Celadon, and I don't want to run all the way back. <laughs> so we're going to try to catch this with the ones that I have. Hopefully, we get a little lucky. Um... You know, you, you never know what's going to happen in these situations. I mean, Snorlax could actually hit me with something crazy. It's level 30. If I can get this thing, that would be such a good grab for the squad right now. Uh, I will be switching Snorlax out with Spooky if I do manage to grab this thing. Is he going to wake up? You mother... He would have snored me. I don't... That wouldn't have hit me, right? I don't know. Would Snore hit me? Is Snore a normal move? God, I hope it's a normal move, because good god, that would hurt. Uh, let's try... Pokeball. He's gonna pop it immediately. <laughs> and he woke up immediately. He yawned me, which... Whatever. If I can at least get one more Hypnosis off. Nope. I fell asleep. Um. I, I feel like I have to hit this thing. There's no way I'm going to catch this thing full health. I'm worried about its headbutts. Oh, God. That is quite a bit of damage. Rocky's a rock. Wait. Yawn. Of course you're going to yawn me. Ugh. So I can get another rock throw off. He might even rest. No, he's not going to rest. Okay, now I'm asleep. I... I feel like I should try a Pokeball, but he's probably going to pop out again, because this Pokemon's hard to get. Yep. I mean, I could chuck a Great Ball at it and would have a better chance, but those are my last resort. Son of a... He's snoring, so that's good. It's not even moving. I imagine if I try one great ball, it'll, pro it'll probably work. Ah, oh, I was hoping, praying that it would work. If he crits me with any of those rocks, he's dead. Ah, oh. he hasn't used rest yet, and that has shocked me, or she, I should say. God damn it. I have four Pokeballs left. God damn it. 
Ah, oh, here comes the rest. Alright, as long as he doesn't snore, I have a chance to wake up and do some damage. Okay, he's not using snore yet. Okay, here's my chance to do some damage. If I could keep him sleeping, which he's not, he rested immediately, so that's good. I, he has to stay asleep for a certain amount of time. Don't snore me. Oh, you snore. Oh, I could probably... I flinched. He snores again, it's gonna be bad. I missed. Wow. That is... Unlucky. I'm gonna have to Pokeball him. Like this. It's not gonna work, but... And yawn again. That's bad. Do I go for the cheeky magnitude? Give me a 10. 7. Definitely not gonna kill him. He might go to sleep on that. Ugh. Every time. One more. Yeah. He does not want to go down. I got three great balls. I didn't want to spend the money. That was the thing. Like uh, I'm still recovering from the flamethrower debacle. Oh my god. Oh, I got him on a great ball. Well, <laughs> it goes against everything that I play Pokemon on, but I finally caught something in a great ball. For everybody that's constantly going to yell at me for never using anything but Pokeballs. Um... I have no idea what to call Snorlax. Sleep. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably just go with sleep. Uh, I'm, I'm not the greatest with, like, nicknames, so... Sleep. And we do have a chance at catching another Snorlax. So, it, potentially, I still could get one in a Pokeball. But, right now, we are going to take this Snorlax, and it is going to join the squad. Hopefully, we won't lose this Snorlax. And I won't have to cry myself to sleep. Because we, you know, lose a potentially good Pokemon here. That could really bounce us back after losing our starter. I mean, I even stopped using Bob a little bit. Because Bob was at level 30. And I'm like, oh, I just, I'm going to use everybody else until his level gets up. I shouldn't have done that. I should have just kept freaking training it over and over again and get its level way up that way he would actually survive and I wouldn't be in this situation this is a weird team I'm not used to using I'm used to always having a starter <laughs> it's so weird now uh, let's check out sleep headbutt yawn rest and snore well, I don't think there's anything I can teach it. I have one great ball left. So, I have to write down that Snorlax was caught because I will for 
forget and try to catch a Pokemon from that area. Brick Break could be a good move for it. Should I teach Giga Drain to Odd Boy? I think I will keep it and use it late game, like everything else. All right. Uh, another thing that we need to go over and grab, which I should have done while we were already over there. Do I don't remember, but did I ever get a bike? I have a bike voucher. I, I went back to Cerulean and I didn't get my bike. Good God. Well, I'll go back and get that after I go here. Because I'm pretty sure that... Oh, crap. Uh, let's put Lucky in this spot. Our love knows no bounds. We're in love and we show it. Alright, we got a double battle. This is a great opportunity to try out sleep. Oh, this was... This would be a good time to have Bob. This is bad. Like, really bad. These two are not Pokemon that I want to take on. I have nothing to take this crap on with. Can I hit both of them? Oh, I can only hit one of them with it. I'm going to have to double team, like... Oh. I might have to switch Lucky out. Oh my good god. I could lose this Snorlax already. Okay, get out of here. Oh, I'm already nervous. <laughs> good god. This is just terrible. The headbutt is strong. I'll give it that. That is one tough... Friggin' Snorlax. Oh, jeez. Uh, you don't like to see that. That was a nice level up. Well, I might have to start training soon. Because... Things are getting a little hairy again. I almost lost the Snorlax that I just got and I could have easily lost Lucky if we didn't get rid of that Nine Tails. We came over here because get back here. We need that HM so we can get back and forth to towns faster. So now that we have the HM we need to teach this to our good old Alright, we're gonna get rid of Gust. Cause that's useless. There's not much point in teaching Aerial Ace now to this Pokemon, unless I want to have a move on it that's like a guaranteed hit because they both do the same amount of damage I'm pretty sure. Uh, right now we are actually going to fly and uh, head back to Cerulean and try to pick up some Pokeballs. We're going to grab our bike because for some dumb reason I didn't pick up a bike. And then we're going to end things off. So while I'm doing all these things, I would like to thank everybody for watching today. If you guys enjoyed this episode, leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe. And come on back for more of the Fire Red Nuzlocke. We got a, we got a nice replacement for Bob. Hopefully we don't lose this one right away. I will try to get the other Snorlax. Just as like a backup in case something happens to this one. Because that, that was some scary stuff. I already have 20,000. Wow. Maybe it's not a bad thing that I wasted that. Well, it doesn't really feel like a waste now. Uh, let's grab 30. Because I feel like I run out pretty quick. 
I don't need any potions. Do I need any antidotes? Let's grab, oops. Let's grab six of those real quick. And then we're gonna go grab our bike, and that'll that will do it for today's episode. Uh, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do in the next episode. I might head down the bike path area, which I I need the bike to go down that way anyway. Um, there's a Pokemon that we can catch on the bike path, and we'll go we'll loop around that way and go towards the gym. And then on the way back, uh, we'll go the other way around and catch the Snorlax on that route and see if that route doesn't connect to another route. Because there's a potential that we could get a water Pokemon in that area. But there's also the water areas down below Fuchsia. So anyway, that's going to do it. I will see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.